Hi there. Welcome to our series on math functions. Today we're going to learn a particular function, but before I begin, let me walk you through this uh, quick scenario. Let's imagine you're taking a poll and your sample of people um, consists of 100 folks. And let's say you grant them access to a spreadsheet so that they one by one begin to fill them in. Each person gets one entry, so when you notice a blank, that means somebody forgot to fill out their favorite movie. Okay, so now a question comes up is how many people actually did enter in the data? What has been your success rate? And so one way you can do it is, there are actually a few ways to do it, but I'm going to introduce one way which uses the function count blank. All right, the great thing about this function name is it says exactly what it means. Um, it's going to count the number of blanks or empty cells. It will return the number of empty cells. Okay, so let's put this into use. Equals count blank. The range would consist of all the data in your data set. So I'll highlight all these rows. And we will assume that Wanderlust is the very last entry uh, for the last person. At that point, the count blank returned a number of 28, which means that 28 of the 100 people that you polled did not enter in their favorite movie. Okay, count blank has multiple applications, but uh, you will notice that when you have especially large sets of data, knowing how many are blank could come in handy. Okay, thanks so much. See you next time.